so today I'm coming out of the woodworks. I'm going to give you and, and try to fill the channel in with these kind of videos, just cool things I've come across as a music engineer. Today's music is being listened to on everything, okay? So a pair of speakers, and I hope you can see this. I, I know that it's dark on this, and I'm sorry, but those little speakers you see in the dark, are called iLouds. They're they're from a company called IK Multimedia. Beside that is their bigger one called the MTM. Those monitors have become really a go-to in, in the recording studio for the kind of mixes in the time that we're living in. People are listening to stuff on Sono systems, uh, JBL pills, Beats by Dre, um, Bose earbuds. I mean, all this stuff. So before the video starts, shout out to my little niece, Sophia. She's starting her own little channel with, with my other niece, Addison, and my nephew's doing the editing. So shout out to them. I had to shout her out because she said, did you mention me? So shout out to her. So this is a cool way if you want to get into understanding a very easy way. Okay, just like a real easy way to, to listen to your mix on a cell phone or listen to your mix on a Bluetooth speaker or listen to your mix in your car if it's if it's equipped with Bluetooth. So there's a company that came out and I just wanted to do this video. So if you're out there and you didn't know about this plugin, shout out to, to Sean as well, Sean Waters for telling me about this plugin like a year ago. But unfortunately, I never even got around to it. It's been a weird year. So I, I actually said, I actually got to use this plugin finally. And I was like, yeah, I should have been using that a year ago. So this is the company. It's called Audrio, I-O, so Audrey I-O. And it enables lo local streaming for $25, okay? Really good deal. The company made it super affordable. But this allows you to place a plugin on your track, Okay, so how this works. Now, Dave Pensada did a video on this, and he sent me that video. But I just wanted to do another follow-up video just for the sake of this company. They they, they deserve it. I mean, because what, what this thing does is really incredible, and I'll show you. So what this does when you buy the plugin is it literally, okay, it shows a connection between my iPhone. So let me try to do just totally redo it see if i can break the thing um you know no technologies bulletproof so what i do is i open up an app and i'll show you what the app looks like on my phone here so this is the app it literally opens up this window that has this blank canvas and what the app does so you go to your app store you download the app and then you go to audrio.com and you download both so you got to download the plugin so I go to the plugin, and um, I open it up on the uh, window here. So I went to my multi-channel plugins. We have it so you can see all the manufacturers, and then I just hit Audrio, and I put that on my final signal, so my final slot on my master bus. Now what's going to happen here is it's going to search for that device, and it's literally going to connect to the device. Now here's the thing that I've been having a little bit of a problem with and I w I'm glad it's it's working right now. So after I shut down the plugin, I have to redo the the app. I don't know why that happened. So that's something that they they might be able to look into, but I'm going to give you the real. This is an iPhone 12. So now I got to open the app back up and you got to make sure that you shut the the app down. But for some reason when I make it inactive, I got to redo it. So let's let's be real with you guys out there. Um, so now I open the app back up. Let's go back to the, the browser. I click on the company. And I open this up. It's going to find the plug. It's going to find my cell phone. And now it says Mac user iPhone. Okay, so all I had to do is relaunch the app. Um, I think sometimes it gets confused, but what we can do now is I hit send and receive. The reason I want to do that is I want to make sure I'm sending information or you can just go to send and you can have actually work with some effects like this and use this as an effects processor using your cell, cell phone as an effects unit. Sort of mind blowing. But the thing is, is now all I have to do is hit connect. It's connecting to my, my iPhone. 
Now, if my iPhone, when I said Bluetooth, whatever my iPhone's Bluetooth to, if it's new earbud pros, if it's if it's my soundbar, if it's my car, whatever it is, whatever the phone is is Bluetooth to, what's really cool about this plugin is there's no latency. So that's a big deal, and I'm going to tell you why it's a big deal. Because I can actually hear changes that I'm making in the mix, and I can do it in real time. If I had to sit there and EQ something like at 8K, and, and then I have to wait 15 seconds for it to translate, I'm going to get bored and I'm going to turn it off and then it becomes useless. These guys made it absolutely latency free and you can actually go in to the settings and you can change the latency. It shows you the potential latency. So what's really neat about this is now I have my cell phone. Okay, and I'm going to show you how this works. So this is a piano, just like a mini piano part. But when I push play, it comes through my cell phone. And you can hear it through this mic. Now let's say I want to EQ that signal. Let's just put a basic EQ on there. And you want to hear how it's going to translate on the phone. It's, it's pretty mind-blowing. I'm not going to lie here, guys. So let's push play. You're going to hear the phone. Now let's take all the bass out of it. Now that's my cell phone. Okay, so I'm hearing the cell phone mix. If I had my cell phone hooked up to, let's say, my Beats by Dre or my EarPod Pros or whatever, I could really get a, a real world look at what I'm mixing and make better decisions based on that. Now, I wouldn't say that's the only thing I want to monitor with. That's just a basic check. I wouldn't start your mix like that. But it's awesome because that's what people listen on. They listen on the, the new iPhones. They listen on the new MacBooks. You can do it to a MacBook, whatever has Bluetooth. So this plugin, and I just wanted to give you guys this because I think it's really valuable, is called Audrio. Google search it, A-U-D-R-E-I-O. And anybody that has a, an iPhone or a, a Galaxy or whatever um, with Bluetooth capability, that actually creates a Bluetooth um, transfer. So it's, it's, I think it's using our network. So I got to make sure that you may need uh, internet connection or Wi-Fi. And I think it does it that way and it creates its own network. So if you're not using Wi-Fi, um, I might have to double check that. But that's a cool thing to, to look at. It's a cool plugin. Um, just wanted to give you another video tonight. My name is Doug Jenkins. If, if you guys have music you want mixed, engineered, I work out of three different recording studios and i do this uh day in day out thank god for that and we'll just keep making videos so once again thanks and continue to watch continue to support and we'll keep the videos coming i think and shout out to my niece again all right we'll see you i'm out